بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم فارمر پرائم منسٹر عمران خان آن ٹیوزڈے فائنلی گیو ہز ٹیسٹمنی ان دا توش خانہ گفٹ ڈپوزیٹری کیس ایز ہی اناؤنس پریزنٹنگ ڈیفینس ایویڈنس ٹو دا سرپرائز آف مینی دا پی ٹی چیف ہو از فیسنگ کریمنل پروسیڈنگس فار ایجلی ناٹ مینشننگ دا گفٹس ہی ریسیو فرام فارن ڈگنیٹریز ڈیورنگ ہز ٹرم ایز دا پرائم منسٹر ان ہی اسٹیٹمنٹ آف ایسٹس اینڈ لائبلٹیز اپیئرڈ ان دا کورٹ آف جج ہمایوں دلاور ٹو میک ہی اسٹیٹمنٹ انڈر سیکشن تھری فورٹی ٹو آف دا کورٹ آف کریمنل پروسیجر Imran Khan came to the rostrum when the judge called his name and later read out written replies to each of the 35 questions that the court had approved the PTA chief earlier to facilitate the process of giving testimony. Imran stated that he had not heard the prosecution evidence as the evidence was recorded in his absence. He said the court also did not frame charges against him in his or his counsel's presence. Imran said the reference said to the National Assembly Speaker with regard to the alleged misuse of the Toj Khanna gifts by him was politically motivated and based on maliciously false allegations. Imran Khan said the allegation made in the reference pertain on the year 2017 to 2018 and 2018 to 2019 but the ECP went beyond the scope of reference with malafide intention in league with the government. To a question with regard to his not mentioning the gifts retained during the year 2019 to 2020 in the statement of assets and liabilities, he said there was no requirement under the law to mention the said gifts in the statement and no such column exists in foreign B that is submitted to the ECP every year. He said no witness from the cabinet division had been produced by the prosecution to depose that the division had sent any list of gifts presented to him along with assessed value and retention cost. He said the list consisted of documents spreading over 116 pages but the prosecution had let no evidence to prove any of said documents by any of witnesses who may have scribed, executed or prepared those documents or under whose supervision these documents may have been. Imran said the prosecution had also not produced any custodian of the said documents. The contents of none of these documents could therefore be used as evidence in this case. Responding to the ECP's claim that he deliberately concealed material facts and submitted false statements and incorrect declarations of his assets and liabilities for the years 2018 to 2019, 2019 to 2020, and 2020 to 2021, Imran replied in the negative. Imran Khan claimed that the prosecution had miserably failed to bring any incriminating evidence against him, which might require me to appear as his own witness. He, however, announced produced defense evidence whose list will be provided to the court today. Meanwhile, the Islamabad High Court has admitted a petition filed by Imran Khan against a federal investigation agency led inquiry into the alleged manipulation of a diplomatic cipher during Imran's term as a prime minister. Earlier, the IHC register had returned the petition after raising objections to it. On Tuesday, IHC Chief Justice Amir Farooq took up the PTA Chairman's petition along with the objections raised to it by the Registrar Office and later ordered his office to list it for hearing.